What's up, everyone? Shoes here. Um, a quarter to six. It's Sunday. Um, and I have a... I just made these. If you see me looking like I'm glistening and sweating in here, it's because I just had the air fryer on and the microwave on and all that stuff. So um, this is a... Ground pork mac and cheese burger. Ground pork mac and cheese burger. Um, and I have put on it, uh, there's ranch dressing, um, French sweet and spicy dressing, uh, Stubbs barbecue, and more ranch on the top. It was ranch on the bottom and the top. And the mac and cheese uh, comes from this place. This uh, Rezzers mac and cheese. Oh, that's where I got my. Oh, they make the chicken salad that I had uh, last night too. Rezzers. It's in a box. And um, got some funyuns. Uh, and this bread is supposed to be a lightly toasted, but not that toasted. Let me see. You know what? We'll do it this way. I'll set it up here now. It might be too much going on for the burger. But I kind of wanted to. Just kind of do that. I forgot buns, so I had to use what I got. This is going to be a messy affair. I did was to let all that macaroni and barbecue sauce just kind of slip out, right? Something like that, something kind of messy. We'll start on this corner. Mm, I can get to it. <laughs> oh my god. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new to my channel. Welcome. I'd like to remember to get that out the way. Oh. Mm. So good together. The mac and cheese with the barbecue and the ranch. Oh my God. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. No paper towel either. We're going rogue. What you see is what you get. Bump it. Um, air fried the, the uh, ground pork uh, burger. Put it in the air fryer. What did I season it with? Um, Minced onion, garlic powder. I think I, oh, the mesquite seasoning I use. I didn't go with the Himalaya salt this time. And I'm telling you what, it is so freaking good. I think there's just enough drippage going on to keep people happy. All right. So we have a new president, you guys. Do you know?
Mm. Oh, I have to tell you about yesterday. I did go live here yesterday, but I personally wasn't really pleased with the live. Weren't that many people. I think people were out kind of busy, doing whatever, having fun. And... Um, for the ones that did show up, I, you know, I do appreciate it, but you all might be looking at this and wondering why isn't it uploaded? Um, and why am I hearing this story again, the story I'm going to tell? I'm, I'm going to tell actually what happened at my job yesterday. Oh. And I also went live on Instagram yesterday for the very first time. I'll tell you about that in a minute, too. First, a bite of my burger. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Not intentionally trying to do it. I have no paper towel. Um, so yesterday, I re you remember me telling you guys about a new um, seasonal hire that we got who um, the first time I met him um, last week, um, I was in the bathroom and in one of the bathrooms and someone kept tugging at the door. I don't know if I told that story. Anyway, someone kept tugging at the door, tugging at the door, tugging at the door, door is locked. And I'm thinking to myself, who is tugging at this door? And we have three other bathrooms in the stock room. So um, I, when I was, I yelled kind of, you know, like, hello. Anyway, I asked another associate who told me it was this guy and he was trying to take uh, his insulin. Okay. Yeah, um, yesterday, shortly after the store opened, maybe maybe 30 or 40 minutes into the day, I wasn't around. I was working, but not in the area where this happened. But my uh, co-worker would tell me that this new seasonal asks him if he could help him and he says can you help me and um uh, you know my friend is like okay yeah and he says i'm an epilep and he falls into the co-worker's arms and i guess down to the floor two other people come uh, uh, now remember i'm not around, but I'm hearing uh, messages over the walkie for the general manager to come down 911. So um, I then, you know, she said something and then I, they were trying to tend to him and put him on his side. And I said, you know, so-and-so, can you come down, please hurry. And um, he had, you know, was having a, uh, epileptic uh, seizure, seizure. And, um, you know, I'm sure they, uh, well, one person was calling the uh, paramedics and um, they were just trying to be there for him. And, 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 you know, I had to tend to something else. But the paramedics arrived shortly after it was pretty quick and when they were there our elevator is a little slow so i said you know 
if it looks like they're getting ready to take him so they don't have to wait for this long ass elevator, let me kind of bring it down so that it's already there so they can get on and then I can let them get out on the side where uh, their, you know, ambulance is. But before that happened, um, <laughs> sorry, I got to eat this. This way I keep you guys in suspense. My tongue is still long. Anyway, before they got into the elevator, I'm looking at one of the uh, paramedic, uh, one of the guys, and the rest of them are kind of around the corner. And then we get this store page, all store page, from our customer service manager who is in another part of the stock room who doesn't know what's going on in the main stock room aisle. She gave the announcement about Joe Biden's win. It was not the way I wanted to find out. I mean, it was the most bizarre, awkward moment. Oh, the, the when I'm looking at this one brother, he's one of the paramedics. I didn't make a sound, but I was like, But, the, you know, the moment it was just like, really, you announce it now. This is so, this is so good. Mm. So that's how I found out yesterday. Um, now I went live on Instagram. Oh, wait a minute. Before I talk about that, the guy is okay. He, uh, they kept him for observation, but so far as I heard, uh, he was, he was okay. This is one of the best burgers I've ever made. <sighs> to give myself a pat. Mm -mm. Pretty good. Um, I did go live on Instagram for the first time. Um, definitely kind of interesting only because I was sideways for the whole time and didn't know or didn't discover how to navigate my tripod until probably almost an hour into the live. So I was sideways the whole time. <laughs> I was still able to read comments, but it it was fun. I didn't keep it, but it was fun. And I think it goes away like it's one of those things that it doesn't stay up forever. So I will definitely go live again on Instagram. Mm. 
Mm. I wouldn't make these all the time. I would definitely switch it up. Maybe ground chicken or ground turkey. Um, and while they were good with the um, whole wheat bread, uh, I don't, you know, it depends on what kind of bun. I'm really not a big brioche bun person, but um, you got to get a bun that's he heavy duty. Heavy duty, not duty. Um, because you're going to have a lot on here and you need something that's kind of sturdy. But just so you know and remember, it's ranch on the bottom, then the burger. Excuse me, then I put sweet and spicy French dressing. It's optional. I just, it was something I thought to do just to add a little something, something but it, it really does taste good. And then the mac and cheese, whatever, whatever, you want to make it your own or whatever. Um, I like this brand. It's a uh, baked macaroni and cheese. You just put it in the microwave, but I love that it. it's really good. Put that on there. And then um, uh, the Stubbs barbecue and then ranch dressing on the top. You don't have to do the onion, fun the Funyuns. I just wanted to do them because I had had Funyuns in a while and they were right there. I was going to put some fries in the air fryer, but I don't feel like having it on. Can't wait to get my Instant Pot this week. I don't think I'm going to make anything, but I just can't wait to get it anyway. Yeah, I really wanted to, to taste the taste of onions. They're really good. Okay. That's it. I don't know. And part of me wants to go live. But part of me is also like, oh, I just want to get in the bed after those burgers and just kind of like. So we'll see what happens. Maybe if I announce it, then people will hang out with me for an hour. Like they. I'll just go live. I don't really announce it. Well, I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, I gotta tell you, I enjoyed this. I envisioned this in my head. I'm sure it's probably been done before somewhere, but I never had it with mac and cheese and dressings and all of that. It's really freaking good, I gotta tell you. And to not have any other type of cheese on it, perfect. So thank you guys for watching. As always, um, like I said, like, comment, and subscribe. Um, glad to have you here. And um, I will maybe see you in an hour or less. We'll see. Take care. Bye.